All right, we're away. Here we go up the main straight. A lot more sedately than uh, the V8 supercars go. Except I think Coxie's in on a, on a mission. <laughs> Swing it over. I can feel the, the, the accelerator pedal's getting a bit twitchy. He is. <laughs> There's the pits. Cleaning the mess. I think we're thinking about next year coming over here instead of where we went because it's uh, a, lot less, a lot less rebellious, I think. And oh, hang on, film the burnings over here. Yeah, it's pretty quiet there too. Yeah, you can see the burnt lounge chairs. It's disgusting. I'm up on the ribbon strip a bit. <laughs> Got to get the ripple strip. Well, we do a nice today at 6 kilometres an hour up here, whereas the supercars do around about 250, I think they were saying, by the time we get up to the top. Sorry, Paddock. Big clean up day today because the uh, fans tend to leave a bit of a mess as you'll see when you get up here a bit higher. And there's rubbish everywhere. This is the in car camera from uh, <laughs> Team Bransden. <laughs> this is very deceptive here, it doesn't on television or I don't know, it probably won't come across in this video either. It, uh, it's a lot steeper than it looks. As I found out in my youth when I rode my push bike up here. Stay on the racing line. <laughs> yeah. But it's two way today. It's hard not to, isn't it? Yeah. This is almost a skyline thing too, except it's not as frightening because you're going up and not not going down. So we've just gone through the cutting. This is what they call Falcon Corner now, as you can see by the signs. When we came in 2000, this, this is, is a, get slightly airborne. This is a yeah. You know, just they hit this little rise here, and they literally fly over it, almost go airborne. We were sitting just where that car is there. Look at the bloody rubbish. Yeah, look at the rubbish. And they fly through here, doing about 160, 180 or more. Up on the ribble strip. Up on the ribble strip. <laughs> <laughs> And you can see some of the carnage, this is where all the dickheads are up here. Unbelievable. When we get up here you'll see... Uh, On that boom gate, see the end of it's burnt out? That was that big fire yesterday. Yeah. They just burnt all the lounge chairs. Keep going mate, keep going. I'll sign up my house. Oh, I see. I think it's Peter Brock. <laughs> Yeah, Brocky! <laughs> no, he's got a Ford, mate. Can't be Brocky in a Ford. And you can see just there where there's idiots have burnt something. And there's an old, there's the remains of an old lounge chair. This is what they call skyline because you get to here and that's all you can see is the sky. This year's race, we were sitting just down here a bit. There's our tree. Right there at that tree. Right on that corner right there we were. That's where Radisich hit the wall. That's where he hit the wall. And you see the red there on the white things. Another one there. There's one there, big skid mark on there. That's where another guy lost it. Here's the dipper. And this is where these guys are nuts. Look at how <laughs> steep this is. Go 
very narrow down here and windy and steep. But you can probably hear that rattling which is our fire receptacle. Aussie male corner, which used to be called well, Aussie male elbow, isn't it? This is, used to be called forest elbow. You've got, to have, you've got to have everything sponsored these days, haven't you, though? This is where Dickie Johnson went off in straight, was there, yeah, straight through those trees through there. Now, there is a copper at the end here, so I'll stick to the speed limits. Yep. Cops like, Hello. like the city with the radar because the boys get a bit carried away on uh, I'd like to, anyone watching this to know I would love to plant it right now. Oh, shit, so would I. <laughs> It'll be good fun. And so along here, they get up to about 250 k's odd. So, oh, was it that much or a bit more? 300, close to 300. Close to 300, yeah. Which would be one hell of a buzz, I reckon. The copper. There's the police man, and he's got somebody. Yay! You'd have to be he's... Dumb. Good on you, mate. Raise that revenue. <laughs> now they take this at about 290. We're doing 70, and I am speeding. Let me slow down. So, Caltex Chase. It would be very frightening if you got to here and nothing happened when you hit the brakes. On course, motorcycle coppers, back at Dan Coxie. These signs that are here aren't normally there, of course, in the race. Couple of the boys in blue. Morning, boys. Ripple strip. Yeet. Whoa. We need steady cam. to the Dunlop Bridge. I'm going to peel off to the left here if they want to go to the pits. Where's that um, museum to the right? Yeah, just go around the left though. I might chuck another lap. <laughs> not a problem. And there we go, that's our lap of Bathurst and we're back into the uh, Connaught's in the main straight rather. So thank you ball boys, thank you linesman, thank you uh, Captain Dave. That's a bit, uh, oh, there he is. And loving it. And loving it. Good boy.